Hi guys, I'm Akriti from Team Pride Champ. So in today's session, I will tell you that how you can make a 3D game on Scratch. So here we go. Over here, let me give you a quick review of that, how you can use the Scratch. So at the left hand side, there is instruction. Then over here, there is a script area. Instruction means commands and script area is for writing code. Afterwards, there is a stage area. Stage area is for representation like how it's working over there. We can able to see from there. First, we are having instruction for commands. Script area is for writing code and stage area is for representation. Then in Scratch, we call characters as a sprite. So I click over here and I can choose a sprite. I can draw the sprite. I can upload it. So this was the character option. Then there is backdrop. So backdrop means background over there. Over there also we are having same functions like search, paint, and upload. In search, we are having the images over here. We can select from here if we want. So in today's session, I will tell you how you can make a Minecraft game in a 3D way. Minecraft 3D way. Okay. So what can we do over there? It sounds crazy like I am starting making a Minecraft way game in a 3D way at scratch. So I click at the paint. First of all, let me delete this card. We don't want. To. I have chosen the line to draw over there. like this and I go further I do like this then again and join it then I will fill the color I click on convert to bitmap and I choose the color from there I think this one is look nice so I select it then at the upper part let me choose the color here we go. Okay. So now what can I will do? I will click over here and choose a tree. I select it. I place it anywhere. Now I will design the backdrop. I click over here and at the ground I want grass. So I can choose grass over there like this if I want some darker color like this I can select it then I click on convert to bitmap I click on the over here I want sky color for sky color what can I do I can make the sky as blue over here and in this, I can make white. So when I swap it, it will be like this. If I want to swap in a different way, it will be like this. Okay. So afterwards, what can we do? I click over here and I want the Minecraft hut. The Minecraft house I want. Let me scroll down and see over there which one I like. I think this one is great. So I do the right click and click on save images and I can save it. There we go. Then what can I do over here? I click over here and upload it. 
I put over there in my now. Open it. Okay, now I go to costume and over here I will edit it. The crop it over there with a little bit additions we have to do. So I'm editing over there. With this we can select it and then we can crop it and then we can delete it. And from here, no. If I cut this, then it will be like this. It's not look nice. So what can I do? I can do it in a smooth way. Yeah, now it's good. So wherever I left with, what can I do? I can use eraser and I can smoothly erase it over there. Let's do smoothly over there. If I yeah little bit little bit little bit little bit okay and at the top i will do and from the sides i have to make a grip over there so that i could move my mouse slowly slowly like this then over here over here so that it could look like a, my real house of the Minecraft. That's why I'm doing it over here. So that the real feel should come over there of my game. Okay, from here also I have done. And from a little bit from here it's left. Oops. Yeah. Let's move turn. Okay. Now from the down I will do it. Let me try to do it over here. Yeah. Then the grass part also I will erase it. Because already I have created the grass at my backdrop, so there is no need of doing that. Okay, then again. Okay, from sides. Oops. If we don't do it in a smooth way, we will trouble over there. <laughs> like little bit it will erase. So always we have to remember that we have to do it in a smooth way. So that our image shouldn't destroy over there. So if we do smoothly, so it's going to look smooth, nice over there. Okay. So it's looking good. Now from here a little bit I left. Okay, now from the top. Now from the sides. Okay, it's looking pretty now. I can make it a smile smaller over there. Now I adjust it. Now I will go over here and choose over there from events when green flag right? So what is one green flag? Like for go there is green flag and for red there is stuff. Afterwards, I go to motion, take from there, go to X, Y, attach it. So, what is X and what is Y? So, these are X coordinate and the Y coordinate. X will be over here. And Y will be at the height. Like this. So, any object we can measure with the help of X axis and with the help of the Y. Oops. 
then I move to the tree. Over here, what I will do? I go to events. Take from there when green flag right? Then go to X Y. Okay. Now I want if I press something, then it will work. I choose over there right arrow then from motion I choose X because right and the left thing always in my X dimension so I attach it I put over there size 5 I do the right click and duplicate over here I will choose left arrow and at the left hand side it will be minus so I click on the green flag I press my click on the green flag. I press my right arrow so it will move in right. I press left arrow so it will move in left like this. Now I will again do the right click and duplicate it. If I choose up arrow, I want that size should change. For changing a size, we want to go to appearance. Appearance is always in the looks. I will take from your change size and attach it. Instead of 10, I can put 5 over there. Again, I will do the right click and duplicate. Over here, I will choose my down arrow. I press put over there minus 5. Let's check out. So, I press up. So, it's zoom. If I press down, it will be key size over there. Now I move to the hut over there, the house over there of the Minecraft. For this, I attach when green flag clicked. Then from motion means movement. Then I will go to the looks. I want that I want it should be a set size. So I put over there set size. So it's large. When I click on green flag, it's quite large. I can put over there 75. So I click it. So it's proper. I go to events. Over here, I drag when space key pressed. It's going to... From the looks, I want that it should change my size. Change size over here. I put over there 5. Again, I do the right click and duplicate. I choose over there A alphabet. If I press that, it's going to do in my decreasing. So, for that decreasing, I put minus 5. Let's check out. I press space, it's increasing. I press A, it's decreasing. Now, I will make over there the arrow. I click over here and over there plus let me type over there plus okay now I can resize over there like this so it's over here I can adjust it over here I go to code I go to events, take from their when green flag clicked. Then from motion, I take go to X and Y. So at X and Y, I want that it should be at my center. So I put this. I click on green flag, it will be at my center. Like earlier was at somewhere place, now it is in center. I go to looks, take from their set size and attach it. Choose over there 75. Let me click. Yeah, 75 is smaller. Now I want that it should appear at my front layer. I click on green flag. It's appearing at my front. If it will be back, I click over here and it will appear. Now I am doing the right click and duplicate over here at the tree. So I can adjust the things over here. With my mouse, I can adjust it. And 
to make a plus over here and this size I can do 75 okay so let's do it I click on green flag I start from here I click on save now let's check it out click on green flag if I press up down it's working if I press space it's working so my that another tree is not working so it's claps over there what I can do over there I can put over there and then I can check both of the things are moving left right space a okay so it's looking like 3d now for decreasing i can put up over there down over there and for decreasing the house i can do this let me tell you at my full screen so i'm pressing it and doing it Okay. In this I can change my directions. I put over there 141 at my X and at my Y I put 9. Let me check it out. A space down. A, like this okay so that's all about it if you have any doubt and query you can comment over there in the chat and i will solve your query please like and subscribe my channel